How's it going, guys? Sorry it's been so long. Uh, I'm back with you with a very exciting video, though. I've got a an unboxing video here for you, and uh, let's get started. Seems like whenever I'm doing these unboxing videos, I've got some sort of cold or something. But I'm working on a cold right now. And uh, I just received this like one minute ago. It's overnighted from Oklahoma. Styrofoam top. Hope everybody's okay. Looks like we need. Need to be doing okay. See some movement. We've got movement. Not female. And here's our male. going along. What's in there with me? As you can see, I opened that up for the first time. Let's open the mail first. So no sort of packaging or anything like that on there. Sorry, no, set, no sort of labeling in terms of uh, paperwork and whatnot, but All good. Because what's important is what's inside these here, these here bags. So, <laughs> beautiful little critters. It's all right, buddy. Paper towels just for any soiling, which they have not done. Some more pygmy pythons. See there? This is a big, this is a big male. Wow. I wasn't expecting them to be so big, but I guess these are 2015, so they've got a couple years to to get some size already. They're pretty cold, but they were well insulated in there, so I'm not too worried about it. Check that aside. A lot bigger than the last. I think these guys can go on little fuzzies right away. That's great. I'm gonna get a weight on them. Let's at least move that into view. So you won't be able to see the, the number on the scale, but pretty wily for a cold snake. 64 grams for the male. And I'm going to hang on to him. I'm actually going to tie him up in his bag. Dude, I'm so happy. So he goes back in the bag. Before I take him down to the basement. This nicely heated enclosure. And then... Female. I believe it was also 2015. These are LASIK animals. Casey LASIK animals originally. From this particular uh, breeding stock, he got it all from Casey LASIK. Oh my god, look how red this female is. <whistles> Sweet, she's so pretty. stinger. We can tell. Look how tiny that little tail is compared to the rest of her body. Like a little bee stinger. 
Okay. She's a pretty good size as well. Gonna be able to take fuzzies, so I'm excited about that. Let's see how much she weighs. Male is 64, I believe. Female is 53. All right, guys. Thanks for watching. I don't want to make this video too big, or sorry, too long. Get the scale out of my way. This is the female. Pygmy python, uh, Enteresia pythensis, also known as the anthill python. These guys are just full of misnomers, so you know, their scientific name, species name is pythensis, um, because they originally thought that the specimen was found, the, holo the holotype was found in near Perth. They're actually up near the uh, Pilbara region of... of uh, Northwest Australia and also anthill. Um, they actually inhabit termite mounds rather than anthills. So, inside, on top of, you know, etc. They move around quite a bit from what I read. And, um, but they definitely are pygmies. They are the smallest python in the world. And now I've got 2.2. Two males and two females, so I'm building up my group. Um, they're just neat animals. I like handling them. Um, I'll take them out and actually, my big male I'll actually put around my neck and just chill with. So they're a cool snake. They can be a little bitey when they're younger, but everything's bitey when they're younger. Um, but I think these guys are a couple years old and they look to be big and healthy. Awesome. Thanks again, guys. Make sure you hit the subscribe button and the alert button to see all of the new videos. Um, yeah, you're not going to get too much production value with, with my videos. I'm just going to put it out there. I'm trying to be better. You should probably be able to see my face. I'm, <laughs> I'm trying to be better, um, but, you know, all that stuff takes time. I'd rather just do a one-shot live, you know, very, very real, very sincere video, and that was an unopening reptile unboxing and that's my new female pertensis thank you and have a great day